Hello and welcome to this Tees to the Point series. Today we will be discussing Liberation Tigers of Tamil Elam (LTTE). First, let us know why they are in news again. Recently, the National Investigation Agency (NIA) has nabbed a senior intelligence operative of the defunct Liberation Tigers of Tamil Elam in Chennai. Let us know something about LTTE. The Liberation Tigers of Tamil Elam were a militant separatist group fighting for an independent homeland for Tamils in northeastern Sri Lanka. The LTTE was founded in 1976 by Velupillai Prabhakaran, who led the group until his death by Sri Lankan armed forces in May 2009. During the 1980s the LTTE defeated a number of different Tamil militant groups emerging as the dominant group by the end of the decade The LTTE successfully carried out a number of high profile attacks including the assassination of two heads of state The LTTE were also notorious for their use of suicide terrorism perpetrated by their elite suicide bombing unit known as black tigers let us discuss the context of their rise that is issues of tamilians in sri lanka one denial of citizenship the problem of sri lankan tamils began earlier than 1950s after independence in 1948 the sri lankan government felt that the tamils were not sri lankan because they had indian ancestry The majority of the Tamils were denied Sri Lankan citizenship due to which most of the Tamils continued to live in poverty in the T estates of Sri Lanka. The second was linguistic discrimination. The conflict between Sinhalese and Tamils in Sri Lanka started in 1956 when Sinhala was made the official language by the country's president and large scale discrimination began against the Tamils. third was religious discrimination the discrimination against the tamil population continued throughout the 1960s as buddhism was given the primary place in the state and the number of tamils employed by the state and admitted into the institutions of higher learning was greatly restricted fourth was intensified movements during this period the tamils responded to their oppression largely through a political and a non-violent protest In the 1970s, however, there was an increased trend towards Tamil separatism and militancy that gave rise to a terrorist organization called LTTE. Let us know something about India-Sri Lanka confidence building measures. One was currency swap agreements. The Reserve Bank of India had signed an agreement for extending 400 million US dollars currency swap facility to Sri Lanka to boost the foreign reserves and ensure financial stability of the country which was badly hit by the COVID-19 pandemic. Second, high level exchanges. Political relations between India and Sri Lanka have been marked by high level exchanges of visits at regular intervals. And thirdly, India's support against terrorism. During the course of civil war, India supported the right of the government of Sri Lanka to act against terrorist forces. Moving on to a question based on this topic. Consider the following statements. The Liberation Tiger of Tamil Elam (LTTE) were a militant separatist group in Tamil Nadu. Another statement. The LTTE was founded in the 1976 by velupillai prabhakaran which of the above statements is are correct option a one only b two only c both one and two d neither one nor two send the answer to this question in comments below stay tuned for next episode thanks for watching have a great day dear viewers watch this episode in hindi on our drishti ias hindi youtube channel